Hey, it's Don from GrumpyGeek.com, and I'm getting ready to test out a drag knife I made. Uh, kind of one of two variants. Uh, it's a little dim in here. I gotta put my lights up that I bought, but not yet. So, and I should have done this before I took the thing. Thing, yeah, I started the video, <laughs> um, but you can see in there, and I'll show it later that this is the drag knife in here, and it's got a. <laughs> yeah, let's see if I can cut myself. Um, <laughs> It's got a blade and it spins on its axis and anyway that's it so we'll see what happens. I test I've uh, rigged up a special lighting fixture to help me with the darkness. Um, not unsafe or anything. Anyway I'm going to hit go and uh, we'll see how fast it takes to break the blade. Um, this is going to be excruciatingly slow at um, 30 inches a minute and it may not even last that long so let's see how it goes. Here we go. <laughs> Looks pretty good so far. Well, so far it looks like it is tracking as it's supposed to, so that's pretty cool. At this point the phone ran out of memory, but you can see the final results. They're a little bit off, which may have something to do with the software configurations, so I'll play with that some more. It also didn't cut all the way through, so obviously I need to work on that, but overall it's not too bad. Here is a shot of the two prototypes I made. I'm using the bigger of the two uh, on the left, but I switched the blade out to a mini blade made by Husky. Uh, I'll try to post some more details about that later. Anyway, thanks for watching.